So you've played through Beat Saber's songs and you're tired of them. But how can you get songs you love on there? Here's how to get custom songs on Beat Saber. Before we get started, this is a guide for PC VR players. It's not yet available on PSVR and it's near impossible on Quest, as Facebook has banned it and any workarounds are entirely temporary. Unless, of course, if you're using Oculus Link. Also, this guide is up to date as of February 2021, but it's still likely to work with newer versions of Beat Saber. If not, check the article down below for the most up to date version of this guide. You can find every tool and step listed in the description too. Okay, first up, let's touch on which tools and sites to use. In this tutorial, we'll be using Mod Assistant for first time setup and installation. And we'll be using Beast Saber to find and download custom maps. We've also put a link in the description to Beat Drop 2 as it's an alternative map manager, but we'll be sticking with Beast Saber. Here's a few things you need to know and do before you start downloading. First is simple. Make sure you've actually played Beat Saber at least once on your system. Moving over to the tools and sites, you should make an account on Beast Saber and download the latest release of Mod Assistant from GitHub. It's pretty simple. You just got to click right here, choose where you want to save it to, and there you go. And make sure you know where the install location of Beat Saber is on your system. This should be either on your standard C drive in the default location. However, if you've installed it in a custom location elsewhere and you've forgotten where, Oculus or Steam should be able to locate it for you. On Steam, I have a custom location. And with Oculus, it takes me to the standard and totally regularly named Hyperbolic Magnetism Beat Saber folder. If you don't fancy using Mod Assistant, which we prefer to use to keep things simple, head to the Installing Without Mod section now. For first time users, which I'm going to assume 90% of you are, who haven't installed maps on your copy of Beat Saber before, you'll need some plugins and mods to enable third party map support in game. Don't worry, it's not as scary as it sounds. Skip ahead to the next section if you've already done this. Step 1. Open up modassistant.exe and agree to terms of use. Step two, open up the mods tab and install. Here you can see some of the options have already been ticked and there's a whole bunch of others that you can install. But right now we're just gonna click install or update to get the basic pre-selected mods to play and install custom maps. You can of course come back and have a look through these, select the ones that you want and again, press install or update to get them. Step three, wait for the mods to finish installing. There you go, see, not scary at all. A couple of notes for this stage though. When Beat Saber updates, your custom maps may or may not be enabled, and patches and updates do have the potential to break mod support. So check back in the original article if it's all gone a bit weird with a new update. You'll just most probably have to repeat these steps again. If Mod Assistant doesn't support the latest version of Beat Saber, it should warn you and ask you if you want to proceed anyway, and we have previously been successful in proceeding anyway. Again, if anything's a bit weird and not working, head to the article below. All right, let's install some custom maps. If you stuck to the previous steps and installed everything that was ticked in step two, Mod Assistant should have a tool where you can search and install custom maps in game. When you load up Beat Saber, look to the left of the menu and you'll see a mods tab magically appear. Click on more songs and there you go, they're all right there. If you'd rather do it from your desktop, head to Mod Assistant and go to the options tab. Under enable one click install, select Beat Saber. This is a first time step and once you've done it, it should be enabled in the future. When you've come across a map you want, simply click the cloud install button and that's it. Again, make sure you're signed into Beast Saber. Now for installing without mods. If you run through all the other steps in the video, you can skip to the last section. Step one. Download your custom song from Beast Saber or whichever site you've chosen, such as the previously mentioned Beat Drop 2. Step two, unzip the file. Step three, navigate to your install location outlined in the third section in this video. Step four, go to Beat Saber underscore data backslash custom levels. And step five, paste the unzipped custom song folder into your custom levels folder and you're all good to go. Again, we prefer using Mod Assistant as it's a one-click kind of deal rather than manually downloading and moving files. But of course, it's completely up to you. And congratulations, you've got custom songs on your PC VR version of Beat Saber. If you've got any questions, chuck them down in the comments below. And if we saved your life with our guide, give us a like, make sure to subscribe and hit that notifications button for all things VR.